Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for stopping by. If you're new, welcome. My name is Jen. Welcome to Jen Plans. So today we are planning for Christmas. We have finally made it to the week of Christmas and I'm super excited. So I have pulled a couple of different washi tapes. I think I'm gonna make this one full blown Christmas. <laughs> We're gonna go all out. So I've got this one. I also have my Christmas Joy, which I'm gonna try and just use a one book today because I know that they have lots of big, bright colors. Um, maybe we'll even use the countdown and we'll go from there. First things first, I'm going to pull my uh, Merry Christmas and my Christmas tape and we're gonna just make a border out of this. So I was actually thinking that I was going to maybe cover this up, but I realized I don't have a, a lot of like really thick ones. So unfortunately that didn't work. Um, but here we are, we're still going to go ahead and do this. Again, I'm just gonna rip these like I did in my last video. It's not that big of a deal for me if it's completely straight. Plus, we'll probably be putting some stickers over it, so that's totally fine. I'm really excited about Christmas and a little sad um, I'm obviously filming this while I'm away or before I go away, I should say, so that I have it for Christmas, but I'm excited and a little bit sad about Christmas this year. I am away, so I am going to try and enjoy as much as I can. Of course, we've got, you know, video calls, which we can do, which is really exciting, um, but it's definitely strange to be away from your family on Christmas to be with your other side of your family on Christmas. So I'm, I'm not sure how I feel about it. I will update you once I am back. Um, again, just my first one away. I know I'll be fine, but first one away from hubby and kids. I think I've mentioned that in every single video lately and I can't help it. Can't help it. Okay, so I've got some Merry Christmas ones there. I wanna take this um, just kind of like pinstripe one here and put this along the bottom. I never used to really be into washi tapes and then all of a sudden it was like something went off in me and said like, you could be using these for all kinds of stuff and you're, you're missing out if you don't use them. So here I am trying to use them a little bit more now I will say, for some reason, these ones that I have, they always feel like they pop up. Like if you can see here, these two sides are already popping up. And I'm, I'm not really sure why. Hopefully that will kind of like settle down once, um, once I start putting more stickers on there. But yeah, for some weird reason, it just always decides to do that. So what am I doing here? I meant to peel this off. There we go. All right. So here is the beginning of this spread here. I am going to start going through this here and I'm going to be just looking for probably the most Christmas like um, I do want to cover something up here, so I think I'm gonna try and do that first. I really didn't wanna use anything but pink and red, or I mean, green and red, but again, I just don't know if that's gonna happen. So I'm gonna try my best. I mean, this already has gray on it, but I wanna cover up the calendar, so. Actually, you know what, that matches because the date and sticker here is same. It's gray. So I think that will work out okay. Yep, yeah, that's fine. Um, we've got some trees and some camels. Maybe I'm going to use these. Let me see if I can get you guys in like the sticker book in a little bit more frame. I know people are sometimes mentioning how they can't see what I'm doing. So maybe if I can, I mean, it's not fully in frame, but it's there a little bit. So I'm going to add these little Christmas trees to the bottom here. Got two different ones here. 
perfect. And then I think I am going to just, you know what, just use these little camels. They can be kind of wandering in the bottom of the page because why not? Actually, maybe you'll be on the bottom and this guy. Oh, I think I just ruined his leg. That's okay. Maybe this guy can be on the bottom as well, but he'll be over here on this side. Yeah, I really mucked up his leg there. Let's see if I can just take some of this one off. Seems to want to keep coming up. All right, there's that. We've emptied out a page. We all love that. Again, I don't know why these are popping up, but that's super annoying. All right. So now I think I did, yeah, I did it too early. Um, last year, I think I used the like countdown stickers, so I don't really have any for this year. This one just says Santa Claus is coming. I'm gonna maybe put that one just underneath him. There we go, cute. So again, like I don't really have anything planned for these, so it's not like I've got a whole bunch of stuff to do. Um, on the 30th though, sorry, on the 29th though, I, I'm gonna put this um, list because this is the day before I fly back home. So I just wanna make sure if there's anything that I need to get done that it gets done before I head home. Okay. Um, the holiday budgets, I don't need any more. Um, we are doing some shopping. This is green-ish, <laughs> but this is hopefully gonna be our day of shopping, which I can't wait for. I don't know why, but shopping in a different town, oops, is always a little bit different. I don't know why it seems that way, but yeah, for me, it always feels like shopping in a different town is completely different vibe. Um, I want to put this here just to kind of fill in some space. Perfect. So it says holiday crafting, but I don't think I'll be holiday crafting in there. So let's, let's see what else. This might just be a time to like reflect over the season. I know that sounds weird, but not weird, but it just, you know, in the hustle and bustle of everything, definitely just take some time to like settle down and kind of like sit back and appreciate everything that's happened over the year. I find like the 27th, 28th, 29th, that's kind of when I, you know, just sit back and kind of reflect on things. So I think that's going to be good. I'm going to go back through this because I thought there was a lot more that I had left, but I have done a good job at doing, um, at just like filling in and using up stickers. So I don't know. Maybe I can use this little mug. We've already got away from doing that. So I'm gonna put this mug just on Christmas day here. Put, oops, I'm just gonna put treats here because I'm a hundred percent sure there will be tons of that stuff going around on Christmas Day. So, okay, we've got our little Santa boxes. I'm gonna pull these actually because why not? These cute little Santas here, put that here. And we're gonna choose this merry and bright. I'm gonna put this here. Awesome. Again, like like I usually do, I am leaving a lot of room to um, write down stuff. Even though I'm not, I don't really have any plans. I do. Um, I am going to be working for a couple of days um, between Christmas and New Year's, so I definitely want to make sure that. 
I, um, I have some room for that stuff. Okay. We have our little birds. They always seem to make an entrance somewhere. Where should I put this little bird? Maybe I can put him here with his friend's trees. I'll take this little wreath. I'm gonna pop that here. There we go. This is looking super cute. I wish there were some little stickers or like snowflakes or something that I could put, but I don't see it. So I'm just going to look at these because there's some stuff in here. Maybe on the 25th we can put breakfast with Santa because who knows, he may just show up to have breakfast with us. I guess we'll have to find out or maybe one of his helpers. This says celebrate this season. I don't know if these are gonna pick up on camera very well, but I'm just putting some of these just kind of everywhere to fill up some space. That one says celebrate this season. That one says um, breakfast with Santa. And then I'm gonna put this one here. This one says holiday style, which is definitely something that we're gonna try to do while we are away. Again, I wish there was some like little peppermints or a little something that we could kind of put around the top, like little snowflakes, but it doesn't look like there's anything in this booklet that is like that. There's just some to-do lists and then some letters, but you know what? I think that this is okay. I, I really like this actually. It's very bright, very Christmassy. We put quite a bit onto it. Let me move it over now that we're done with that. There we are, you guys. Let's go ahead and pop this into our planner for the last week. Awesome. So I have been updating, so I guess we'll, might as well update this during this plan with me because it kind of is the last week that I'm gonna be able to to do this, but if you watch my previous videos, um, we had a, we have a kind of like a holiday playlist that we are going through. So as you can see, I've, I've clicked off a, a couple that we've watched. I actually have watched a couple of bonus ones that we, I actually didn't even know existed, but let me go ahead because I did watch um, Elf. So I did watch this one. We haven't really watched a whole bunch yet. So um, I only have Home Alone. I haven't even watched this yet. That's my favorite. Um, we watched Christmas with the Cranks, A Christmas Carol, Elf, and then Candy Cane Lane, Office Christmas Party, and then Family Switch. So there was one more, but I can't remember what it's called at the moment. So I'll have to update that. But it looks like I'm gonna have to do some digging and relaxing and get some of these watched before the end of the year because that was my plan to have, you know, at least 10 of them, at least 10 movies. Um, but it's been such a crazy time that I haven't had a chance. But anyways, you guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please feel free, feel free to like and comment and subscribe. I hope that you guys all had a very, very happy holidays, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, all that good stuff. And um, we will see you in our next video. Bye guys.